Hello everyone. In this class, we learn how to find limit of a function by factorization method. In last class, we learn how to find limit of a function by direct substitution method. For this problem also, first we try by direct substitution method. In direct substitution method, put x equals to minus 1 in this function. When we put x equals to minus 1, what it is? Minus 1 whole square. Minus 1 whole square is 1. 3 into minus 1, minus 3 plus 2 divided by minus 1 whole square. As square is there, it will become plus 1. 4 into minus 1, minus 4 plus 3. See, 2 plus 1, 3. 3 minus 3, 0. 3 plus 1, 4. 4 minus 4, 0. What we are getting? 0 by 0. What is 0 by 0? 0 by 0 is called indeterminate form. So, the limit of this function, indeterminate form. We cannot say like that. So, we need to find another suitable method. That is factorization method. We try to calculate limit of this function by direct substitution method. We are getting indeterminate number. So, we will calculate limit of this function by factorization method. By factorization method. When we use factorization method, when given function is of this form f of x divided by g of x, where f of x and g of x are polynomial functions. Now, we put x equals to a in f of x and g of x. If it gives indeterminate form, then we use factorization method. As we substituted x equals to minus 1 here, we are getting indeterminate form. So, to do this problem, we use factorization method. In factorization method, we will find the factors of this function and this function. First, I will find the factors of x square plus 3x plus 2. How to find factors of this function? I will find factors of this function by splitting middle term. See, this 3x. You split this 3x as sum or difference of terms such that after multiplying these two terms, we must get multiplication of these two terms. Here, 3x can be written as 2x plus x. If you multiply these two, I should get multiple of these two, 2 into x square, 2x square. So, split this middle term, it can be written as x square plus, this 3x can be written as 2x plus x plus 2. In these two terms, you take x common, you will get x plus 2. Plus, in these two terms, you take 1 common, x plus 2, that is equal to x plus 2 into x plus 1. So, what are the factors of x square plus 3x plus 2, x plus 2, x plus 1. Here, no need to calculate all these things. From after this step, directly you can say, see, x plus, what is the coefficient of x? Coefficient of x is 2 into x plus coefficient of x in this term is 1. So, directly you can write x square plus 3x plus 2 as x plus 2 into x plus 1. Now, I will find the factors of this x square plus 4x plus 3. I will split the middle term. I will write 4x as 3x plus x. 3x plus x is 4x. When I multiply these two, I should get multiple of these two terms. 3 into x square is 3x square. As 3x into x is x square. Now, how we write this x square plus? This 4x is written as 3x plus x plus 3. As I said here, we can write after this step directly how x plus, what is x coefficient? 3 into x plus, what is x coefficient? 1. This can be written as x plus 3 into x plus 1. Or you find difficulty to write directly, in these two terms, you take x common. What you will get? x plus 3. In these two, you take 1 common. What you will get? x plus 3. So, what it can be written as? x plus 1 into x plus 3. So, we calculated factors of f of x and g of x. Now, substitute their factors. 
limit x approaches to minus 1. What are the factors of x square plus 3x plus 2? It is x plus 2 into x plus 1. We got this as x plus 2 into x plus 1 divided by x square plus 4x plus 3 can be written as x plus 1 into x plus 3. See, these two will get cancelled. Now, what is remaining limit? x approaches to minus 1 x plus 2 divided by x plus 3. Now, I will try once again by direct substitution method. Put x equals to minus 1 in the given function. If it gives the finite number, we say that that is the limit of this function. Put x equals to minus 1. Minus 1 plus 2 divided by minus 1 plus 3. What you will get minus 1 plus 2 is 1. Minus 1 plus 3 is what? 2. So, what is the limit of this function? Limit of this function is 1 by 2. For any problem, first we will try to calculate limit of a function by direct substitution method. When we try by direct substitution method, if we get indeterminate form, then we will go for another model. This problem we can do by using factorization method. I written the factors of this x square plus 3x plus 2x plus 2 into x plus 1 and factors of x square plus 4x plus 3 is x plus 1 into x plus 3. I written those things and further simplified, I got limit of the function is 1 by 2. I hope you understand this factorization method. If you want to follow my classes, please subscribe to my channel. Have a nice time. See you next time.